At Sticker Mountain, we can use both raster and vector images in order to print your stickers and labels. What's the difference? A raster image is built from these tiny squares called pixels, and those pixels make up a bitmap. These bitmaps create a highly detailed image. The more pixels that you have, the higher the quality image. On the other hand, as you scale up the image from its original size, you notice that the quality lowers. This leads us to vector graphics. Vector images are created using mathematical equations of lines and curves to produce images. Since they are made with equations, vector images are infinitely scalable without losing any quality. How else are they different? Raster images are usually taken in the form of photographs using cameras or even your smartphone. Vector graphics are created using computer programs, such as Adobe Illustrator or Sketch. Raster images can be more complex, allowing for wider variations in colors and details. Vector graphics still can hold rich colors, however it's a lot harder to be as detailed as a photograph. That's why they're often used for making graphics, such as logos and illustrations. They also differ in file size. Because raster images are created using pixels, it takes up a lot more space, thus a bigger file size because it has to store all the information of all those pixels. Vectors tend to be a lot smaller since all the information they are storing is mathematical equations. Typical file types for each are JPEG, PNG, GIF, and PSD for raster files, and AI, PDF, EPS, and SVG for vector graphics. When do you need to use raster versus vector? Raster images tend to be best if you need the details of a picture, such as the ones you take with your camera. Vector images tend to be most used for illustrations and graphics, and are better if you need them to be scaled indefinitely without losing the quality or having large file sizes. Each file type can be converted into the other. However, it is a lot easier to save out a vector file as a JPEG or a PNG, rather than redrawing or using the Live Trace tool with Illustrator to get a relatively decent vector image. At Sticker Mountain, we can use both raster and vector images to print your stickers and labels. It's best to provide us with the highest quality artwork you have. That way, we print exactly what you have in mind. Have any more questions? Check out this playlist or visit our website for additional resources and help. Sticker Mountain, the best part of us is to be a part of you.